love when a tool comes along and grabs my attention. This tool is for anyone that shoots on iPhone or other iOS device. If you ever want a better sound for your videos, then this is the most important show that you will ever see, ever. If you're shooting on an iOS device, you could do with some help as regards your audio. How many GVs do you end up leaving mute because the audio is just too noisy? Or you get home and your interview is too quiet or too noisy? Well, all that can change with a new tool from Akisonis called Mauvio. Mauvio is a suite of plugins that perform several functions like denoise, deesser, and others to bring out the best from the sound on your video for use later. Now, before I get going, for transparency, I don't have any affiliation with Akisonis. I just think this kit is absolutely brilliant. Don't forget, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. I will get back to you with any help I can offer. And also, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of this amazing Adorama content. Firstly, when you start the app, you have an option to open an existing video file or use video from the camera. Let's look at each function and how it can help you clean up your video's audio and make them possible to use or simply rescue unusable audio. So I downloaded the app from the App Store, open her up. It's just checking do I have authorization for it. Big plus, okay? So we hit the plus and we get a choice, do we want to use the camera? Or do we want to take something from the video library? So of course we've taken something earlier and this is what we're going to use. So let me just grab that. And there's me. Tragic. So that's just going to import it into Malvio before we can do any of the processing. Okay. And when we're finished the processing, we can share it out. We can share it to our desktop for our editing package or do whatever. Instagram or wherever you generally share your stuff, you can directly share it too. With the demo, I think you get 10 shares and then you buy it uh, unlimited shares by the month or the year. Okay, so have a look at that when you install it from the Play Store. It'll tell you exactly what you have to do there. So this is going to take a second because it's a nice long video. So it's just going to take a second to upload. Okay, so it's importing now. And as I said, we have the nice big preview window. And that loops the video all the time. So we can just keep checking, keep checking, keep checking our processing all the time. Then the progress bar for the win for the video. And then there's the big before and after buttons. Okay. And then below we have balance, enhance, denoise, denoise, uh, deepener, which is a new uh, module that they just released a couple of days ago. Deesser and volume. So let me run through those while the video is importing. Balance. Balance is bringing some sort of balance and, and it, they say it affects the voice and brings timber to it, makes it sound better. So as I say, you can pull these in and pull these out. So Malvio is an experimental bed for your video. If I'm recording some ambience, some beautiful field, like I shot a meadow um, a couple of days ago and I was practicing with this, I pulled it out and I only used denoise because that brought up the sounds of the meadow beautifully, got rid of an awful lot of traffic noise that was over here. And it was just gorgeous. It just brought up the nice stuff that I wanted to hear. Whereas we're going to be dealing with dialogue now, which will bring in other modules like DS, Enhance, Denoise. So we'll use these modules as we go. So let me just play this. Okay, so there's me chatting away and that's fine. I'm just going to put on some headphones so I can hear this properly. I really would advise you to plug it into a proper interface with proper speakers so you can monitor it properly. Not these buds stuck into your iPhone because you could do more harm than good with this. This is gently, gently, slowly, slowly, okay? And then you'll find the nice results. Okay, here we go. How many GVs have you ended up leaving mute because the audio is just too noisy? Or you get home and your interview is too quiet Okay, so first things first, we're going to bring up the volume of the whole thing. So that's my first step, but be careful because it brings up all the noise as well, the noise floor. Okay, so I'm going to turn it on, go to volume, 
and the volume brings up this slider bar. Simple, bring it up. Now I've brought it up to 150%, okay? So that's grand. Now, see the balance? I'm turning that off. I'm turning off Enhance. I'm turning everything off so I can bring them in and make sure that everything's sounding okay. Okay, I don't want to go too quick on this. It's all about experimentation, turning off the deepener, turning off the de and the noise. Hear all that noise? I've gone right down. Now I'm going to slide that slider up nice and slowly. This toggles between the video sound and the Now hear the difference. I can go more. The section below that changes depending on the option that you select. See how much I've brought out now. It's phenomenal. I'm going to start talking in the video now in a second. I'm going to bring that back as well. Just give it a bit of air, a bit of air. Okay. I love when a tool comes along and grabs my attention. This tool my Vorn before and after. An iPhone or other uh -huh. iOS device. If you ever want you hear a better that? sound for your videos, then this is the most. Now do you hear the artifacts coming in? You will ever see. I'm pulling it way too much, way too much. You hear it now? If you're shooting on an iOS device, you could do with some. Do you hear those artifacts? Audio. We we don't need that. So we're going to pull it back a wee bit. I'm hearing a lot of de-essing. I'm going to the de -esser. I can go intense or normal. I'm just going to go normal for the minute. That's just to take all the S's, all those S's, de-S's off. Deepener is what they say makes you sound more like you sound to yourself. So it's just going to put in a bit of resonance in the bass end. For use later. Do you hear that? Now, before I get going, I have absolutely no Hear the resonance? It's going on too ringy for me. So I'm going to go and bring back the denoise a bit. Give it a bit of air. Give it a bit of air. It's okay. You're in the scene. You're in the scene. So let's go and look at Enhance. Deepener, I'm going to turn on again. Click the subscribe button so you don't miss any of this. It's all right. Let's pull it back a wee bit. Enhance deals with the dynamic of, of how you speak, the quiet bits when you're talking down here, and then the loud bits when you get louder in speech, just naturally as you get more excited. It balances out those levels to a more consistent, it's like a compressor. So we're going to turn that on. Do you want to use what you just shot? Otherwise, you select the video. That That's bringing in an awful lot of artifacts that I don't like. I just don't like them. So I'm going to turn that off. Let's wait for him to talk. Now that you have imported the video, this is where the fun begins. Now you hear the, the main difference? The shows the video preview that loops your video. I'm and losing in hands. I don't want to hear it. Some shots, some videos, it might work beautifully for. Maybe if it was closer, it might. It might work beautifully. So finally, let's just look at balance. The section below that changes depending on the option that you select. So it brings in a bit of exciting. But now I'm going to go over to de because I can hear all that extra stuff coming in. I think we should have enough there, yeah. I love when a tool comes along and grabs my attention. I'm hearing a lot of artifacts, so I've got to be real careful. On an iPhone or other iOS device. If you ever wanted better sound for your videos, then this is the most important show that you will ever see. Yeah, I'm going to lose the balance just for giggles because I don't like the sound of it. If you're shooting on an iOS device, you could do with some help for your audio. How many GVs have you ended up leaving mute because the audio is just too noisy? Or you get- So for this reality. specific video, I've used four modules. The volume, the de because I'm very sibilant, all that S's, and the deepener, just to bring a bit of body into it. And I only threw that in just for giggles. It might be better off if I dealt with that in post, okay? The denoise, the denoise is great, but as you saw there, don't bring in too much. Otherwise, you're going to hear those artifacts. It's doing an amazing job. It's doing a super job, but it's got a lot of work to do, especially with this distantly mic'd thing. I mean, the iPhone was miles away from me, but that's usable now. And it brought up the volume. I think these modules, you have to play with them for the specific situation that you're in and the specific thing you've just shot because... As I say, with the video of the meadow that I shot a couple of days ago, it was brilliant. Just bring in a bit of denoise and a sound of magic. This dialogue, now I've brought in four modules, you know? In other videos, 
I might lose deepener, I might lose DS, and I'll bring in balance and enhance. It's for you to play with, and it's an amazing tool. It is a really, really brilliant tool. So get it from the App Store, or whatever they call it nowadays, and have a play. Malvio is a serious tool for people that shoot on iOS. I would suggest that you do your processing when you get home, ideally through an interface that can be used with iOS and that are plugged into decent speakers, or at least with a really good set of headphones. I'm Keith Alexander and you've been watching Adorama TV. Don't forget to subscribe to Adorama TV for more great videos and tell us what you think. You can like, you can comment, or you can share this video. And please come by the Adorama Learning Center for more great tips and tricks.